Hi everyone, Rabbi Yoni Katz coming to you uh, from Boca Raton, Florida. And sort of in continuation to my post from the other day. So, most people will say that God wants us. God wants us to serve Him. God wants us to worship Him. But as soon as you say the word need, many people, or most people, especially Orthodox, religious people, get nervous. And the question is why? Even for a five-year-old child, they shouldn't want what they don't need and need what they don't want. So definitely God. Does God need what he doesn't want or want what he doesn't need? Of course not. So why did God create the world in the first place? You can't say he did it for our benefit. We didn't even exist. So how could he do it for our benefit? We didn't exist. So why did God create the world? It was an internal desire. It was coming from His absolute essence. So does God need us? By logical deduction, obviously, like we said before, if He created us, then He needs us way more than we need Him. We didn't even exist yet. So the motivation from creation came from His essence, the absolute core of God Himself. Wow, that changes everything. For generations, people thought, and this is usually the religious mantra, if you want to get people to be religious and orthodox, you have to promise them what's in it for them. Do you want a big slice of heaven? Well, then you better get your act together. Do you not want to go to hell? It's always about reward and punishment. Hasidic philosophy came and introduced a whole deeper way of looking at God. God, we're here for you. We're here to fulfill your mission, your purpose of creation, whatever we can do. Is this a novel idea? Is this so radical that people have to argue against it and fight it? It's the opposite. This is what make God, makes God lovable and allows for the relationship to happen. So does God have skin in the game? Did God create the world out of vulnerability? His deepest need and desire to have a relationship with us? Of course. And with that in mind, that's really what motivates us to serve God.